welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to unbox a product and review it. So here is the product that I bought today from Walmart. This is actually a sewing machine. As you know, these days we just stay at home, we don't do anything and we are just so boring. So why don't we just try something new like sewing hobby or something right so I bought this from Walmart the price was around $99 this sewing machine is from Singer so from the Singer website it's around $110 so it's quite uh, cheaper from the website so this is the box a Singer 3337 So actually for me sewing machine is not uh, new I've been working with sewing machine for so long and to be honest my grandma is also tailored so this is not a new thing for me so in this here they list the things that they included in this box and we're gonna see if it's there or not. Okay. Alright, let's open this box. I think you need a for this, mommy. First of all, I would like to say some disappointment from, uh, I don't know, from Walmart or from the singer. Because when I received this box, it has some kind of tear here. Hopefully, there is nothing wrong happen inside. If there is something wrong happen, we should return it. Alright, we are opening the box here. Be careful, mommy. It's okay. This is... The instruction? Yeah, the instruction and the uh, warranty card. The warranty card? Mm. And then this one, uh, kind of the machine cover. The machine cover? Mm -hmm. What is the machine cover? Like this. Like this. <laughs> and now we are going to take the machine, machine out. My husband will help me to Pull up this machine, it's somewhat hard and heavy. Can I pull you? Right. Thank you so much, sweetheart. Me? You and Daddy. And we put the box aside. Yeah. And this is the machine. Here, let's open this foam. Ta -da. So they already have some uh, thread here and here is the food press and they give us this kind of installation ins instruction here and then they give us a quick start guide kind of paper like this so yeah and here they give us the bobbin with little bit of thread and they actually have put the thread in to this kind of hook around here until down there I hope you guys can see that the thread is there and they give also the bobbin inside this here is actually a compartment oh it's a lot of things here 
so these things all was in the packaging and I put it out so these are all the things that come with the machine uh, I'm going to try the machine is it working or not properly all right now I'm trying the machine so it has some kind of light here I hope you can see that light and here I have just a piece of fabric and I'm going to try it will it work or not hopefully it works It is so loud, like a gun machine. And here they have like cutter, so then we just need to cut the fab, the thread. But I don't know why it's not cutting. Okay, <laughs> it's cutting. This is the fabric after I stitch. It's so nice. It's so tidy. This is the stitches it's so straight and nice and clean this is the back side from the fabric i mean the thread the thing that makes me somewhat scared not scared like like a shock was the sound from this uh, machine the sound was somewhat loud as i told you before it's like a what is that gun machine it's like duk, 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 duk. i don't know it's because of the table that makes movement even more so the sound even more or it's just from the machine itself like that and since this can be you know removable so then if you have some something like a sleeve like that it will be easier to you know rotate and to control the movement now I'm going to try another uh, the stitch style. This one is straight. Now I'm going to try zigzag one. This one, yeah. Okay, let's try the zigzag one. Always, never, ever forget to uh, put the this clutch, the back side down whenever you wanna uh, so you will not get something like knot or something underneath the fabric okay the zigzag also nice just little bit somewhat loop loop around here it just maybe my the tension is not in the right position here in the machine it has the stitch length kind of uh, knob and this one is the pattern that the, they provide it has a lot of pattern here and then this one is the reverse stitch when we wanna start and and uh, stitch and then here the tension number if we wanna be so loose or or wanna be so tight here and here is the threader threader for the bobbin here and here is like a knob to make uh, the needle up and down oh, and also in the machine they have the automatic thread kind of thing so you don't need to manually put the need uh, put the thread inside the needle as tradition the last time i use sewing machine is about 10 years back and i still have to put the uh, thread inside the needle so and here they have the cutter the uh, thread cutter unfortunately it doesn't seem so sharp so i will be using my scissor and yeah this is so compact and as you can see they it has like a handle here so it meant to be mobile you can put it everywhere as you wish and here is the bobbin so as you can see here they have the uh, measurement from one inch three 
and eight and five and eight and so on it 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 will be depend on the how wide or how narrow your hem will be like as you wish so yeah i think that's all for this review and unboxing video of this singer as you can see after the brand singer and then simple yes this is so simple there is no like a computerized or something everything still you know manually adjust just it's just simple and beginner friendly maybe just one thing that bother me is the sound is so loud that's it other than that i have no problem i'm happy with the purchase from walmart and if you want to buy from the singer.com the price around 110 dollars and then from walmart the price was around 99 dollars well, here is the first project that i made for my daughter and this dress um, actually so easy and as you can see it's quite tidy and nice so, I'm going to about this sewing machine So yeah, this is the machine. Hope you enjoy the video and if this video is helpful, please give me a thumbs up and share this video and see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.